welcome this is the energy vibration reading <laughs> okay people um this is the energy vibration reading for the cancer sun moon and rising this has been one of the best best reading for you cancers and i cannot believe that i went half of the reading and my camera wasn't going and it was such a positive reading <laughs> okay we're gonna go from the beginning okay uh, ladies and gentlemen this is the fourth week of august 2017 and the week begins the week is going to begin from the 21st until the 27th in this month of august we have five weeks so please go back and listen to the monthly readings from the third week until the end okay or you can go back all time and listen to the monthly reading and pick out that week because i've, I, I've been trying to tag them um because of my location because i've changed up so many things this year um I can't do my videos like before when I used to bring up the cards and tag them because I'm I'm in a rush. I'm, I'm doing a thousand things, but anyway, you can sis congratulations. It's going to be a wonderful week. Finally, things are happening for you can sis. It has been a while since I haven't seen such a beautiful reading. This week is the week of the energy vibration of the fire in the first two days and it changed to the energy vibration of the hurt your water sign. So what is happening is that there is balance coming in. This is going to be good for you guys because you have um, two major arcana and that is uh, um, judgment and the eye princess okay what is happening here is the number seven energy is and number three number three and number seven um, energies or here three plus seven is ten ten um, one is a new start okay um, with energy vibrations and with numbers only when we're having numbers three four times coming up the same number three times coming up then is there a message but with this zodiac energy number it goes from one till nine so anything after one till nine come down to one number okay so here we are here we're going um this week we have water so it's going to be a good day on monday for you guys monday thursday and saturday uh, thursday friday and saturday it's going to be good this as a matter of fact as a matter of fact this week is going to, is a promising week for each and every one of you it's a very promising week on monday there is the energy of judgment but this judgment is just good whatever that has been happening this is a good judgment it's going to be screaming out of you it's a positive judgment you have the nine of pentacles so this is good okay whenever you have the energy of judgment with a nine of pentacles this is really positive this is a positive endeavor this is good this is where you should be at um, the message that is coming in the um, you know the screaming that is coming in you can deal with it because it's all about money 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 so this is going to be good for you guys on Monday on Tuesday we have a fire energy and this fire energy is a new start coming in for a lot of people new foundation has been built a lot of people are liking you a lot of people wants to uh, connect with you a lot of people want to work with you a lot of people are seeing positive things in you so this is very nice this is the energy where the good things are about um, to start for you so whatever that has been happening to you in the last time you're going to see that new doors of opportunities are going to be opening and people will be connecting with you in whatever way okay you're crowning from your week it is the energy vibration of the ten of pentacles and this is positive because whatever it's not only if some people will have for the energy vibration of the nine of pentacles with this gifts of money and this is you know good amount of size of money and gifts coming in but a ten of pentacles is going to affect each and every person in some way or another uh, for some people it's going to be a week where you have found work and you realize that the work that uh, the career change that you have made is going to really make you money and this is going to be good whatever the situation is for some people is that if uh, there was um, 
there was money as you know like um, your your air, air finesse was taken away or stolen from you um, if money was stolen from you from family members who stole from you if an insurance um, payout was not done um, if um, you know um, they with old um, organizations you know government organization whatever your work if you were working some place and they didn't pay you and they hold certain money uh, it's gonna all come out it's as if the wheel of fortune is bringing you this financial um, abundance and whenever the ten of Pentacles comes up it's always money unexpected money money that people has tried to steal is going to return to you and this is going to be good okay so money that people try to steal from you is going to return to you and this is going to be good as we move forward on Thursday, it is going to be the day of the healing for the women. Whatever um, situation, traumatic situation that you have with people from a soul family, um, a cosmic family, or a earth family. So this can affect people who you know who are around you in your family your kids yourself your husband and your wife your families your sister and your brother but yet still this can also connect with you on the work floor because people on the work floor are always a um, soul family or cosmic family and some it can affect people in different ways where you have certain situation and that is people from other sort of uh, intergalactic on um, beams and so so for the people who are vibrating on the fourth and fifth dimension you know exactly what I'm talking about so this is going to be a day of healing so you're going to heal the feminine side of both you and that person whoever that person is so Thursday is going to be a day of healing as we move forward we're looking at Friday which is another good energy because the eye princess is here she comes up for most most of the water sign um, people in this week and the eye princess is here and uh, what is happening is that she is bringing someone to you who's bringing you true love okay the high princess is uh, um, the major arcana which is uh, um, these are like um, deities. I call them deities because there's just certain, just different types of beams, and uh, um, you know, we have the deities, we have the major arcanas, we have the masters, uh, um, the ascendants masters, we have the 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 the, um, the angels, we have the goddesses. Uh, um, there's so much different deities that you can call upon the I princess the I yeah the I princess is one of those beautiful she's um, is connected with the hermit whenever the I princess and the hermit comes up in a year reading or in a reading is that your spiritual side um, the mighty I am present is calling out to you. She is the feminine side of that mighty I am present, and the hermit is the masculine side. So she is bringing in love, especially for the people between the ages of 18 and 35. This is going to be another healing on Friday. So whatever is happening to you, Cancers, it's going to be a positive healing in this week because uh, you have the energy vibration of the feminine side the feminine entities the healing of the feminine entities and you have also the healing of the people between the ages of 18 and 35 so this is positive so look out for this on Friday because there's going to be a positive positive healing on Saturday most people will be walking away from a um, certain situation so the situation can be you know you have come to an end of a journey and you're going on a new journey it doesn't have to be that you're walking away it can be that you are looking for better um a better place in your life a better emotional place this is more of a you or leave it a sort of um, emotional pain behind and moving on to something that is uh, much better you have yield whatever the situation is you you got you got you've gotten a lot of money there's a lot of money that came in on Monday so um, this is going to help you to um, 
actually realize and see how wonderful this is because you're moving yourself to a place a positive place in your life so this is good as we look on we have the energy vibration of the princess of Pentacles the energy vibration of um, the princess of Pentacles whatever had happened between you and this person she has won okay she has won okay whatever that you did against this princess of Pentacles she has won the battle and won the game fair and square you have realized that you have done certain things to this person and honestly this person was not have no absolutely no um, hate in her heart or whatever you know go back and look and really understand what you did to this person um, she has forgiven and she has moved on it will never happen that you will meet this person in another lifetime because this person came in this lifetime to help you see who you are and that you're not yet on the path that you're supposed to be whatever happened um, she is turning her back on all the situation that has happened and she's moving forward this is so positive because this woman was an honest to goodness good person whoever you are you can says because you're always connecting with the Capricorns um, with the people who carry the energy vibration of Capricorns and whatever has happened you have not seen what you have done and this person is moving on this person wants to move on they are ready to move on okay so if you have a relationship with a Capricorn person she is moving on she is leaving she is moving on um, for some people who are having relationship with the the Tauruses or the Virgos they are planning on moving on okay if you have a child that carries the energy vibration of a Taurus a Capricorn or a Virgo they are moving on um, they feel that it is time that they go out there and make um, things on their own they want to um, make things and build something new in their lives on their own so whatever that has been happening this these these earth people decide to move on from a situation that hasn't been healthy for them and whenever these earth people are in a situation that are not healthy they always plan their way out okay so again to recap this is a week of balancing your financial situation it's going to be a very good balance because your crowning of your week is the ten of Pentacles again with the seven of swords that means whatever that was stolen from you will return whatever that was stolen, whatever financial that was stolen from you with a financial emotional cannot be returned but financial whatever gifts whatever that was stolen from you will be returned okay so we're gonna look at this week on Tuesday it's gonna be a positive energy if you're looking for connection with business and with other people in the business it's going to be very positive whatever the situation is that you're looking to work with groups of people on Tuesday it's going to be extremely positive as we looked at Thursday Thursday is going to be a healing for the women out there whatever situation that is going on you're going to be healing the feminine side of who you are so the beginning of the week you are going to get a surprise a surprise of um, information coming to you that you are going to receive the nine of Pentacles okay whatever it is if you had buy the lottery the week before try and start buying the lottery people try and start buying the lottery this is going to be good it gives you a chance to win one day okay as we move on and we look at the energy vibration of the six of 
cups and uh, um, the energy vibration of the princess of Pentacles whatever is happening here this woman decide she is going to be victorious and she is victorious over you let her go let her move on let her go let her move on whatever that has been um, the situation that has been playing let this woman go let her move on because it's time for her to move on okay so um, Wednesday and Thursday is going to be a positive day for love um, on a Saturday a lot of people will be healing the emotional conflicts that you have here we are completion completion and this is wonderful this is a positive reading that really 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 says completion this is really what this reading is all about whatsoever has happened there has now become a completion of situation in your life a completion of where you are emotional a, a balance is a return a completion of whatever that was stolen will be returned to you so the energy of the orange is the solar plex chakra um, call upon Archangel Uriel to touch open and activate your solar plex chakra the color you should use is the color of orange you can call upon Archangel Metatron if you don't work with the angels you can call upon the um, orange ray to flow through you and protect you in this week okay this is a wonderful wonderful energy as I am going to the last card whatever messages whatever question you have I mean <laughs> okay whatever question you have you need to understand that you need to trust whatever question you have you need to understand that you need to trust trust in this week is going to be very vital in your life you need to trust you need to believe when you trust you're giving the universe a chance to say that yes I do believe that this is all going to happen to me so trust this is a time for trust Some, sometimes there is no yes or no to a question there are situations where we are better served by not knowing what is coming so that the miracles can unfold before our ever eyes like children opening a gift part of the magic of our lives is found in the joy of surprise trust that your angel have something amazing in store for you even if you can't uh, quite tell you yet what to do okay so be aware of this this you have to learn to trust okay there is a completion in your life of something and learn to trust and do not let it exceed the scarred as somebody is going to die because it can be the debt of your emotional pain okay the completion to your emotional pain you're letting go whatever the emotional pain was because I know a lot of us carry around emotional pain I do it you do it everyone do does it we are all on a journey and it takes our it takes us time to really release certain things and heal certain things in our lives okay so I want to say to each and every one have a wonderful week namaste until next week